Welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voice inside your head. I'm Jonah. I'm TNT9. I'm Mike the Explosive One, and we are playing Wheel of Fortune. We are, sir. The category is phrase. All right, phrase. I'm ready. I'm ready oh for it. Oh my god, there's a phrase. lot, dude. Oh, wow. Days gone by. Something days gone Memories by. of days gone by. Boom! Memories! Light the corners of my mind. Is that a real song? Misty water colored memories. <laughs> I'm not hit to the old song. Of the way we Let's get this round started. All right, before and after. That's one of them songs that, like, people's dead grandparents used to listen to. Oh, I see. It's like, tie it up yellow ribbon around the oh, old oak tree. At least we've started off. Great. Tie a, what? Tie a yellow ribbon around the old yoke? Tie a yellow ribbon around the old oak tree. It's been three more years. Do you still, you know, that one? I mean, I guess I've heard it. <laughs> I don't know. And live grandparents don't listen to that. Dead ones did. Yeah. Like, my great grandma would have listened to that. Yeah, that kind of stuff. Yeah, because, I mean, back then there was only, like, nine songs to listen to, so. Because, <laughs> like, like, I don't want to put my age out there, but, like, 20 years ago was, like, when that song was, like, for grandparents. So, mm, okay. Yeah. I could see that. It's good to know, like, you know, what old people used to like. Grandma's in there with, like, the, the rollers in her hair, making butter from scratch in the kitchen, listening to Old Oak Tree. Yeah, and you know what's crazy is, like, as, as, as a person gets older, they, they tend to, like, just stick with that music that they knew when they were a kid, and that's the music that was playing when they were a kid. That's true. I don't see myself putting old 80s and stuff on the, like... <laughs> I don't know, you dude. Want... I'm trying to. I'm trying to contradict you there, but I don't know if I can say it. Yeah, like, uh, T is T's gone. What do you want? Oh snap! It is. Uh, let's take the S then. Like, I mean, I would listen to '90s stuff, but not '80s. '80s was like when I was a kid. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I mean, but that's the same age I'm talking about for them. It's like that's the music they used to listen to when they were younger. Anywhere, from, I guess, like anywhere from like kid to like before you graduate high school, like teens yeah. into even like your early twenties, essentially. Yeah. Whatever music is popping With then is kind of the music that a, a lot of people revert back to. Oh, well, we get a free letter, yeah, and like, yeah, and exactly, and like, and it's, and I think you really only end up liking it because uh, it's what's popular, what's on the right. It's like what everybody's listening to your age. I mean, yeah. like you know, you get stuck with like some people got stuck with like dubstep as like they're they're be like yeah. ninety. You're going to be 90 in the home listening to what letter? <laughs> I'm waiting for that to happen, honestly. Um, wow. And yeah, there's and like, I yeah, there's a 70 year old dude listening to Skrillex in the home, dude. Like, it, I mean, and that's going to happen. It is. It really is. Because people love dubstep. Um, I just feel like when you always, get old, that might be too intense. I mean, I feel like you guys can't, like, take a shower and listen to Skrillex. <laughs> like, I don't know. You, you, there's certain, certain like, outside elements that have to, like, the, the planets must align for it to be time yeah. for Skrillex. At least for me. I don't know. Some people might be like, oh, I think I'm going to take a short nap. Let me put some Skrillex on. Let me put some cradle of filth on and take a nap. Wait until the beat drops. Like, I'm, I'm not listening to that. <laughs> but I can 100% say is that if I think to like what my favorite album of all time is, it is definitely it happened in that time period when you were like thirteen yeah. to eighteen ish. Do you, do you have Do you have a favorite album? Mm, man, I like a lot of albums all the way through. I know, but is there one that sticks out? Like one, like you're on a desert island, you can only oh, bring I've this said one. Oh, I've this a million times. Like, and it's it didn't even become one of my favorite albums till till I was older. Uh, Kid Cudi's first CD. I just think it's such a good okay. like. It's chill. Plus, it's like it has some nice stuff to it. Plus, you know, it's okay. But, I'm not mad at that. But actually. I didn't listen to that when I was 15. No, no, no. I didn't even listen to that when it was new. I got I got hip to it like six years after it came out. Oh, okay. So I mean, I was like way past its. Prime. So yeah, you 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 missed out on the initial push for it. Okay, and right. that's fair. Nine hundred. But you, my favorite album it, it's just going to be so re weird but it, it, it is Ja Rule's of debut album it's called Vinny Vetti Vici 
and I tell you right now, I can go back and listen to that anytime, any day, for any reason. I could sleep to it. I could take a shower to it. <laughs> what, I could uh, have I could have co- coitus to it. Coitus? What do you uh, What do you want here? I have no idea what this is. It's a before and after. C, because that's call. I'm sorry, there are none. Okay, it's yeah. wall. If you'd like to wall of beans. I guess Call of Beans didn't make any sense either. Yeah, um, yeah, but I don't know. Like, there's other albums like that I would listen to. Like, Red Hot Chili Peppers, uh, Hill Bill? of Beans, something Hill. But uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers, Blood Sugar Sex Magic, really good album all the way through. Like, Everclear, Sparkling Fade, like Sublime, Sublime, Sublime Horny Asses to Freedom. Like, <laughs> Matchbox someone... 20, Yourself or Someone Like You, <laughs> The Wallflowers <laughs> Bringing Down the Horse. This is the stuff I used to listen to. Oh, Jonah Hill of Beans. So it's it's a before and after with a proper name and a weird saying. Yeah, I figured it was a before and after either, but I thought it was going to be call. It's beans. never be been honest, it's never been a proper name mixed with something else. I mean, we weren't focused. I think <laughs> But I wouldn't have got that anyways. I probably would have. If we were more focused. You would have got Jonah like, Hill? Yeah, I know who Jonah Hill is. I know is. who Jonah Hill is. I like Jonah Hill. He's cool. Yeah, he has pretty, he's, done, he's done some good movies, he's, man. He's an ally. He's good. I think. <laughs> you go online, he's like slandering everyone. Isn't he Jewish? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Okay. All right. This is another What Are You Doing? I wonder what his real name is. I don't think his like, real name is Hill. Oh, his last... Yeah, almost all celebrities have a fake name. Mm-hmm. Because they want to have a name that, like, is presentable to uh-huh. the world. Except for, like, Will Smith. Because I, uh... Yeah, because I remember hearing a, uh, uh... An article... That girl, uh... What, do you want tea? Yeah, G. G? Okay. Yeah, definitely. Um, Emma Stone. That she... Going... Mm-hmm. Something, something, something. Um, let me out. think real quick. Going, going out. out. Going. Anyways, but I remember her saying that like her real name was something else, and somebody else was already called that, so she had to go by Emma instead of like whatever. I don't. Mm. Know. So it's like they, they just pick a stage name. Going ham. <laughs> <laughs> we going hammers, hammer, hammer. Going ham on it. Not a single one on the board. Ness wasn't you, there. Good thing you changed your name. Jones, do you know what going ham means? Will we get any uh, I probably don't know the true nomenclature. What is it? Do you know what ham, ham, no? I mean, tell me. It's a, it's an acronym. Ham is hard as a mother effer. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, I'm going to take... Let's it's that going. nobody says who that, any? by the way. So don't think that you could would be cool if you were around going bu- ham? if you were out <laughs> with a bunch of kids. And I could already see you doing it because you're already got that mad dad energy. Be like, what's going on, guys? We going ham out here? <laughs> no, no, never. Are, are we going that. hammer? I would never say that. <laughs> are things lit? <laughs> what's lit? What's lit? Are you going? Are you guys you, going ham? You can <laughs> always tell the dad in the room because they put emphasis on on the slang. Yeah, but, like uh, if it's out of Urban Dictionary, they're gonna put the emphasis what, on that. What do you want? Um, let's take the T now because there's definitely. Tea oh, I didn't there. realize the T was up. There's wow, not it's tea not going this. out, huh? <laughs> yeah, they're always like, "What's fresh, dog?" <laughs> And you're like, yes, fresh. Dog. <laughs> yes, yes. The till day is above fresh. I get it. The one large TV. Or one large tail day right above the fresh. All right, so going. Contestant number two. Oh, that girl's a thought. <laughs> you see her emphasis? Look, look at them thoughts. No, we don't see. And see, and like if you if you're really into the slang, you, you don't put. You the just say it on. like you would normally say anything yeah, else. Yeah, you'd be like, man, she a thought. I don't even mess with her. Right, right, exactly. Not that girl's a thought. I don't mess yeah. with her. Oh, hey guys, you guys think thoughts are hot? <laughs> <laughs> It's going. It's okay, it's yes, going for a. Okay, this is this is, this is, this is helpful. Going so it's not ring. Going for a. I'm gonna actually fill it out. Going for a something ride. Wild ride? No, I think w, so. W's gone. Oh yeah, it is. Going for a test. No, um. Fire, no, higher, higher Meyer, ride. fire, by die. Going for a Fidra, hide ride. Going for a ride ride? <laughs> the R's not there. Uh, going for a mile, no. Love you. Going for a, 
May, nope. Bid. What do we got for other continents nothing. here? Nothing. We got a D. L is already gone. Mind the ride. No. Time is running low. Mice. Nice. Remaining. No. Mice ride. Yeah, we're going to have yeah. to skip. I don't know. Yeah. That's unfortunate. I don't know what the hell that is. Will yeah, we get any help on okay, this? good. He got it wrong. That's good. Boom. What do you got? Yeah, we ha he this if this guy solves, we lose. There are oh. none okay, on good. That's fine. We right, I'm gonna it's your it's your pick, so I would take the D. You want the D? What else would I take? Well we know the F is up there. I know the D is up there. Oh that's true, yeah. Damn, dude. Contestant number one, would you like to solve? Oh my god. Going for a bike ride. Good job. Dude, oh my Good god, job. that was hard. Good job. Good job. Good Jesus. Job. Good job. God. I knew I could count on you to get it. <laughs> oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Wow, I was not wow. so sure of myself. Jesus, that was challenging. There we go. I, just knew, I knew it took some focus, man. Let's we lost started. one puzzle because we weren't focused. We're again. talking about albums. <laughs> right? That's fine. Got the like A in America. Yeah, you dang right, Jonas. That's the grade we're going to get on this next puzzle, too. <laughs> Around the house. Jesus. As always, we will give you five consonants. All right, R so I'm going to take L -N -N this. A vowel. Jesus. Of course, here's You're the part where I'm going to take my Jesus? No. P. All right, what do you want? You take, get your own Jesus. <laughs> take your Jesus. Your own personal Jesus. Hey, uh, let's take that D, actually. And then let's take a, let's take an A. Wow, you made that look easy. We did. The yeah. only thing we got was A. Wow. Just a few moments. To wow. Solve, so go quickly. And this is around, around the, house. the house. What the hell? I don't know. Not feeling good about this. No, one. no, me. It's neither. that second word we need to. Yeah, get we got to get the second word to at least have any idea what the first word is. So. Cat hat bat. Bat. Bath mat. Bath mat. Okay. Bath mat. That's good. Okay, bath mat. It's just an adjective, so like. Yeah. So let's see what we got here. Uh. Bat. Mm. Bath mat. Um. Father. Uh, ma. Water. No. No water. No ma. Bath. Let's see. Uh, we got 10 seconds. We're good. We're good. We it sucks because I can't fill out the second half first. Yeah, I know, right? I, I have nothing. It's it's just going to be an yeah, adjective. Yeah. yeah. All right. You can, you can skip. We don't know. We don't know. Bamboo bath. I would have never got that. Wow. Bamboo bath mat. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bamboo wow. is not. Yeah. yeah nope. Nowhere near that way. Nope. That's hey, right. I'm, I'm proud of us for getting bath mat. Yeah. But, but yeah, anyways, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Hit me up. Hit, hit up TNT. We no, don't hit me. Don't hit us up. <laughs> for Jonas. TNT. Uh, we are out.